Okay, so today I'm going to post a video to uh, try and get more people engaged and involved. I think it's an opportunity for us to understand what I'm trying to do and then hopefully us coalesce around an idea to help with the rollout of Marriage Evolved. First things first, I am going to try and mention everybody who is currently uh, a member of the group, which is the dumbest thing that I've ever thought of because I will probably butcher names, so I apologize already. So, with that being said, I'm going to read off the names of everyone who I am very thankful for being part of this group. Jacob Nash, Nikki Antonio, Trans Ohio, Columbus, Ohio. That's not really a person, it's more of a group. Uh, Logan Freedom, Ohio. Oh, Logan, I'm not saying your last name. Terry Penrod, Flo Williams, of course, my amazing husband, Stephen. Lori Nicole Madison, you look a lot like uh, President Obama. Holy mackerel, Mary Jo Kilroy. Uh, Cheryl John Cox, Dan Stewart, Thad Sheffel, Jessica Jeroma, Denise Maria, R.L. Pete Hoseman, Heidi Williams, Daniel LaPointe, Jasmine Baker, Gina Stenbach. Hi, Gina. I loved it when I saw you for our cruise. Oh, um, <laughs> Sherry Slides Downey, or Sherry Siles Downey, sorry. Ryan Everett Long, Lori Tesler, uh, Pam Smith, Tim Peters, Ren. Margaret, Boy Grant, Carol Powers, Thinky Dink, I don't think that's your real name, Thinky Dink, Zach Attack, don't think your real name's Attack, last name, Meredith Camel, I got to go on a cruise with her, she rocks, Don Cox from Cleveland, love her, I know her personally, Tony Gagnon, went to high school with her, hey Tony, Sammy Durbin, William Padola, Padilla, Liz Mills, Bishop M. Heckman, Liberty Manos, Akron LGBTU, that's obviously a group, Autumn Get Equal Leaf, Gwen Andrix, Ian James, hey Ian, keep going with the petition. Oh no, I just hit the wrong button. Um, I think it was at Ian James, right? Oh, this is horrible. It's going to take a lot of time to make a video. I'll, in about five seconds or whatever, I'll put on here how far away you can skip to get past this part. Lee B. Golden, Rachel Hockett, H.J. Onion, we went on a cruise with H.J. as well. They're our new friends. Heidi. Charles Anthony, he did an amazing video as a drag queen. Uh, Jean McNeil McFay, Russ Goodwin is a personal hero and a veteran who you should all love, as well as Brian Endicott. Tan Beebe, Joni Fiber went to school with her. Erin Nasty, probably one of the best bloggers you will ever read from. Richard R. Roy, David Haberman, Don Schwartz, Holly Stone, Kristen Marrow, Nella McMallon, Lee Bear Golden. Lee, I think you're on here twice. Alex Sawyers, Mark Zabo, Thomas Gale Notch, Andy, Andrew Murphy, he's from my house. Um, no, my hometown of Cleveland, Stephen Howell, he's a teacher, love him. Tom Get Equal Morgan, he is a crazy advocate, and that's my dog. Uh, Tom Get Equal Morgan, who is a crazy advocate, and in one of the videos that we shot for uh, Get Equal Speech, we did. Roger Barker, who is a really good friend of mine, uh, he is from Dallas, I met him through Aaron. Jen Stack, amazing person from here in Cleveland, Cleveland Columbus, I don't know where I'm at apparently. Scott Terhune, he's from my hometown. James Linnett, and then of course me. I don't really want to thank me. I'm just on the list, and so I listed my name up. So I apologize. We are three minutes and 30 seconds in, so I'll put it in the link that um, that's how far you need to fast forward in order to get to the main message. So the point, the point of today's video was really to talk about Marriage Evolved. All of you have been awesome and signed up for a private group uh, for the Marriage Evolved piece, and really we want to talk about what to do, what next steps are for the rollout. Marriage Evolved is going to be a website that is basically uh, has two functions. The third function will be later on in life if things go properly and we'll talk about that in the his, uh, later on in time so we won't necessarily worry about that right now. Function one, the website is going to be all about activism from individuals who want to make a message. Marriage Evolved's logo looks like the word me because marriage evolution or marriage evolving, however you want to put, is about the people that it affects. It does not just affect M the LGBT community. It affects our allies, it affects our parents, it affects our cousins, our aunts, our uncles, our best friends. These individuals all support us, and the best way that we can get them to buy in to what's going on, to support us, is by making sure that they make their voices be known, and that we spread that message so that people continue to join the collected effort and the collected voice of all the individuals who are truly affected by this. 
People are saying that marriage equality is going to ruin their marriage, that is, it's, it's going to ruin their definition of a traditional marriage and all of that good stuff. It's not true. It doesn't affect them in any way, shape, or form. The same thing as individuals who are on their fifth, sixth, seventh wedding. People who are celebrities who've been married for 73 days and then divorce. Individuals who are atheists who don't necessarily follow the religion that they believe in. It doesn't affect their, their, their marriage. It never has. And marriage hasn't devolved because of the LGBT community. It's only 50% successful as it stands right now. So we need to show who it really affects and who marriage evolved actually will impact when it comes through. And it will. I honestly have the confidence behind that. So marriage evolved will be all about the individuals who are truly affected by marriage equality. So what does that mean? Marriage evolved is going to be two things, like I said, individuals who submit videos to say how marriage evolved will affect them. For example, marriage evolved affects me because I want my marriage to be recognized in every state and by this great country. It's as simple as that. People who have kids, marriage evolved affects me because I want my son, I want my daughter, my grandchild, I want them to be able to marry the person that they love. So we're going to collect videos, hopefully from individuals all across the country, that explain how marriage evolved affects them and what marriage equality will mean to them when it finally goes into place. The second piece is providing a domain where individuals can interact. One of the biggest challenges is, as a gay community, it's hard for us to find mentors or individuals who can help us come out. Our families don't necessarily understand what it's like to be gay, and so when it comes to the point when we've decided who we are, when, we've, when we're confident with who we are, and we've decided to take the next step to come out to families, it'd be great to have a resource that's available there for us. So using this community, if you will, that's out there, we'll have chat boards, forums, any, any number of resources where individuals can come together to talk about ways to come out, ways to talk to individuals who are straight, to find out how we can openly discuss something without being upset, without taking things personally, and try and help them understand how we're truly affected by this situation. That's really the main thing, and you're all part of the initial rollout. What I'm gonna be asking over the next few days is that you go on YouTube, you record your own statement saying how marriage evolved affects you, using the statement me, because that's the logo, and get ready to upload the video to the website. Now, I'll probably very shortly put the website up on the private group, but understand that the website's not done yet, and there's gonna be a lot of changes. The idea of a profile being built, though, will remain. We'll probably clean up the website, add some funner graphics, make it more colorful, and make a much more attractive landing page for the community domain itself. But right now, this is the website, and you guys get to be part of it and see it go through its evolution. So, over the next few weeks, we're gonna be looking to you guys to interact, to participate, and to facilitate. We need additional people to join the group. We need people to come on board and really be part of this. And the only way that will happen is if each of you takes a serious stake in this. A lot of times people join things like It Gets Better and all these different groups when it's hot and fun and cool. Each of you took the time to get invested in this before it's anything really. And that's what's important. We have people in other areas and people who are running other little private groups to start and get this, start to get this moving, who have their own collected audiences. And I need us to be the most powerful group out there so that when the website launches, we are the ones who made the most impact. I'm really excited. I think that this webpage is above and beyond anything else. I think that we have a way of making a resource for the LGBT community who isn't out yet, who is out, who's thinking about coming out, who's struggling to have a resource to look at when it comes to allies who support it, and of course the LGBT. The most important reason why I think Marriage Evolved is a catalyst is because if marriage equality comes through, if it's legal for the LGBT community to marry, a number I think all the laws that discriminate against the LGBTQ community, we will be a legitimate, recognized commitment between two adults. And with that, you can't discriminate. Candidates will no longer be allowed to stand up in front of crowds and compare us to bestiality, or say that we need cured, or say that it can be prayed away, 
or cast this off to the side without repercussions. Right now, candidates can openly discuss us as if we're a non-entity, second-class citizens, individuals who aren't even important enough to recognize or respect. So when marriage equality falls into place, that will not be the acceptable norm. It will be looked at as an outward discriminatory act and will not be accepted by either side. So I look forward to Marriage Evolved being an amazing website, an amazing resource, and an awesome viral tool where individuals will post their statements, make their voices be heard, and a collective group of hundreds of thousands of people will let it be known that whether they're gay, whether they're straight, it doesn't matter that Marriage Evolved needs to happen, and it needs to happen now. And you guys are all going to be the beginning of it. So I thank you, I love you, and uh, keep tuned in because, yeah, we're going to rock it.